wake up, a new day is dawning. There's beauty and happiness everywhere. Jump up, destiny's calling. You and your friends have so much to share. Swinging through life on this great adventure, the spirit of nature will see you through. There are lessons to learn about life and its mysteries. Lessons of love that are waiting for you. Look up, there's joy all around you. Nature is wondrous, but beware. The law of the jungle has a lesson for life. But you can still soar right up to the sky. Hold your head up high. Keep your courage inside. And sure as the sun and the stars up above, you will discover love. I smell danger. Mowgli must learn about this. Not yet. I have to make sure you're clean all over. You know that. <laughs> Seems like a waste of time. I'll only go out and get messy again. Mowgli, I haven't finished yet. We'll do it when I come home. You always say that. It's Baloo. If he catches me, he's going to teach me stuff all day. Hey, Bacchus! Did you see that rabbit? Rabbit, did you say? Where? Oh! <laughs> yum, yum! There you are, Mowgli. I've been looking for you. Well, that's that. So you fooled old Baloo, did you? Good for you. He worries too much. Maybe, but he knows a lot, Baloo does. Okay, so he knows a lot. But he's told it all to me, so I don't have to listen anymore. I fooled him, and that proves I'm smarter than he is. You're not smarter. You're just sneakier, that's all. Why, you? Just ignore her, Mowgli. Come on, let's go and play. That's right, go and play. Go and play your silly games, you bunch of babies. It's all you're good for. I have better things to do. Babies? You better watch who you call babies. Right, Lala, we aren't babies. You are. <laughs> I say I can do anything better than you, and I'll prove it. We'll have a contest, I dare you. Anytime you want, Lala. Well, I don't know if this is such a great idea. Sura knows the rule. Don't bite off more than you can chew. You poor kids are in over your heads. You better back down before it's too late. Back down? Not on your life! Hmm. Okay. So, you're taking up the challenge. Shall we race? You're on. I bet we can beat you to Mowgli's Marsh. I see Lala's conned someone into playing with her for once. I could have ran faster. 
faster if I'd wanted to. But I didn't want to hurt your feelings. Listen, Lala, I've got a better idea for a test. I'll race you over to the island and back again. Mm-hmm. I'm just going to beat you again, you know. <laughs> Go on, Mowgli. You can do it. Mm -hmm. Ready, set, go! Well? That's an angry looking bear, Sura. Angry? He's furious. <laughs> Abru, Sura! Hey, that's no fair! I beat you again, Mowgli. You did not? Well, maybe you did, but I'd have beaten you by a mile if it hadn't been for Baloo. It's Baloo's fault? Come on, that's just an excuse. I told you I'd prove it. You're still a big baby, and I'm going to tell everyone. Mowgli? I was winning that race, Baloo, but she beat me again, and it's all your fault. You know it's time for your lesson. Hmm. All right, I'm ready. Now listen, Mowgli. You may hear a new sound or pick up a scent you're not familiar with. Stay away from it. Well away, do you hear? Because it's probably a cold fang. A cold fang? What's a cold fang? Fear it. It is different from all the other dangers in the jungle. It's not alive. Come on! If it's not even alive, why should I be afraid of it? Because there are some on the north bank of the river. The north bank of the river? Right. <laughs> and another place to watch out for is that tuft of reeds in the stream. <laughs> and they... A frog! <laughs> Mowgli. <gasps> oh, why did you have to do that? This is important, Mowgli. You must pay attention. The frog was important. So was my race with Lala. And you spoiled it. You always spoil everything. You go on and on and on, and I have to listen to you for hours every day. It's boring, and I'm sick of it. I want to play, so just leave me alone. If you want somebody to talk to, go see Akela. Mowgli, you can't go yet. I haven't finished your lesson. That's what you think. Mowgli. Oh. I'm sorry, Mowgli. Too late. I never want to see you again. Huh? Oh. oh, Mowgli. Wait a second, Baloo. I understand that you had to teach the man cub his lessons, but did you have to hit him as hard as that? Mind your own business. Be that way, but you'll get no more advice from me. Huh? Uh, uh, you and Baloo made so much noise you woke me up. The two of you really get worked up about Mowgli, don't you? I'll have you know I never get worked up. <laughs> what is it you find so funny? If you're that worried about him, why don't you go after him? That's why you came, isn't it? Ridiculous, Kichi. I came to get a drink of water. I'm sorry, Mowgli. I 
just wanted to warn you. Silly old bear, he can just keep looking. I'm gonna find some place where he'll never think of looking for me and I'm gonna play all day. I wanted to warn you about the cold fang. I wonder what it's like. It sounds creepy, but it might be kind of interesting. Blue would never look for me there. Yes, that's where I'll go. <laughs> <clears throat> Baloo. <clears throat> uh, oh, hello, Leary. Um, I just dropped by to see if Mowgli was at home. Uh huh? I thought he was with you. Oh, well, uh. Um... Mowgli, where are you? Oh, fancy meeting you here. <clears throat> Has something happened to Mowgli? Uh, well, I. Uh... <clears throat> What's the matter, Bagheera? Uh, I wanted to have a little chat with him. Nothing important, you understand. Just to tell him to mind his manners. He's been a bit saucy. Unlikely story. You spoil him, Bagheera, and if you don't stop, you'll spoil him rotten. You're a fine one to talk. Bagheera, tell me what's wrong. Don't worry, my dear. It'll work itself out. Mm. Goodbye for now. Oh, dear me. Mowgli's done it again. Kayla is sounding the signal to assemble early. Attention! This is serious. Has anyone here seen Mowgli today? Oh, I didn't, did you? No, I haven't seen him since yesterday. Uh, Kayla? This morning, Mowgli and Lala were with Sura and me, but he was going to spend the rest of the day with Baloo. Oh. Uh, Kayla, I must know the truth. Baloo? The fact is, I lost my temper with him today and I cuffed him. So he ran away and hid and I can't find him anywhere. I see. Well, he can be very irritating at times, I know. Don't worry about it too much, Baloo. Mm -hmm. That's right. Why worry? He was asking for it, so forget about him. I can't forget about him. <laughs> this morning, I heard the dreadful sound of the cold fang. Oh, oh. Be just I told him it was right. dangerous, but he wouldn't pay attention. So I hit him, and that's when he ran off and left me behind. He doesn't understand the law of the jungle, yet he doesn't know what happens to those who break it. 
If he gets hurt, I'd give anything to bring him back, but I can't do it alone. Please, all of you, will you help me search for Mowgli? Find him. For the honor of the wolf pack, Mowgli must be found. Agreed? Baloo, thank you for all you're doing for Mowgli. I'm not doing it for him. I'm doing it for me. What? Mm -hmm. Akela, if you find him, call. I'll start looking. Luri, someone has to stay behind at the lair in case he finds his way home. I know that, but... He will need you here. I think you're right. Lala, aren't you going to help the others look for him? Why should I? I don't care what happens to him. Not one little bit. But if I was the one who found him, I could really tell him off. <laughs> but don't forget, beware of the cold fang. Bagheera, aren't you going to join the hunt? Akela, do you know what Belu said just before he left? That he wasn't doing it for Mowgli, he was doing it for himself? Tell me what he meant. was a long time ago. Baloo was no older than Mowgli is now. wild one. His mother tried to teach him the law of the jungle, but he wouldn't listen. She never had a chance to warn him about the cold fang. Stop, Baloo! Come back here this minute, do you hear me? No, Baloo, don't go down there, it's dangerous. No, Baloo, no! Baloo! Oh! Oh! Uh, 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 uh. I can smell the scavengers, the wild dogs. Mother! Go now. Run for your lives. There, the dolls. By the time we wolves arrived to help, only Baloo was left. We chased the dolls away and took Baloo back with us. Poor Baloo. It was a hard lesson. But that was how he learned to obey the law of the jungle.
Not the river. Oh, no. He wouldn't go there. Special way he's beginning to see. 